grace is multiplied to us as we grow in the knowledge of God and in Jesus Christ our Lord. And growing in the knowledge of God is having the understanding to know him intimately, that he is Lord who exercises kindness, justice, and righteousness in Jeremiah chapter 9, verse 20, 24. That we are to have this understanding of who God is. Having that understanding to know him intimately. You know, it's like a, a couple. When you, you know, a couple gets to know each other by what? By hanging out. You know, they go out to dinner, they share their intimate moments, you know, things about them and how they are able to, to, to live their life together. And so they share their intimate moment uh, time with each other. You know, they don't, you know, they don't sit across the table and go, okay, I got to get my text. I got to text my wife. Your wife's sitting right across the table from you. No, it's being intimate with each other. It's having that relationship where you get to know the heart of the one that you are married to. It's the same thing with us in our, in our relationship with the Lord. We get to be intimate with God. We get to know the heart of God when we spend time alone with him in his word. We get to understand the heart of God for me and for you. Because we are able to sit there and, and have our devotional life time with him. We are able to sit there and read the word of God. We're able to sit there and pray and communicate to God our hearts. You see, that's how we understand God's heart is when we communicate to him what's going on in our lives. But man, if you never communicate, you're never going to know the heart of God. 